Fisheries and Oceans Canada's Pacific Biological Station is situated on Departure Bay in Nanaimo, British Columbia. More than 250 people work at this world-class research facility. They're involved in a broad range of programs designed to better understand fish and fish stocks, provide quality science advice to fisheries managers to ensure that fish stocks remain healthy and productive, and promote a greater understanding of the state of our aquatic ecosystems. Much of the science and research at the station is supported by work in laboratories. Some labs are used to test and study samples to determine the health of all manner of aquatic species. This work helps to identify diseases of concern, pathogens, or parasites. Key science used to control the spread or movement of diseases and ensure continued global confidence in Canadian seafood product exports. I've been doing science for my whole adult life and I'm just never cease to be amazed and excited about what we're doing and every day I wake up I can't wait for for the new discoveries. <laughs> In other labs, molecular specialists, researchers and technicians use the latest technologies to understand genetic aspects of a variety of species and how they respond to viruses, pathogens and environmental changes. Results of this work inform important decisions about how we manage our aquatic resources. And in the scleral chronology lab, or fish aging lab, specimens from the field are processed to determine the age of a fish. This data is used for stock assessments and making decisions on fish harvesting. The station also has a system of tanks and a phytoplankton lab, which allows scientists to study live animals on site. But research also happens in the field. The station has an on-site experimental farm where studies can be conducted in a more natural environment, particularly those related to aquaculture. Work like this is extremely rewarding. I mean, to be able to work at a federal research institution that's right by the ocean and be able to work at a, a working farm site that's, you know, one minute boat ride from where my office is, you can't beat it. It also has deep water piers making it a launching point for scientists heading into the field to collect samples and gather data about fish populations and ecosystems, as well as physical ocean properties and systems. Other programs at the station are working to protect marine mammals, species at risk, and advance marine protected areas, assess fish stocks, particularly wild Pacific salmon, monitor and predict changes in our oceans and freshwater systems, and understand impacts of human activities. This is a terrific environment for collaborative research and for exploration and discovery. So I, I couldn't think of a more valuable place to do this kind of work than the Pacific Biological Station. Science at the Pacific Biological Station provides key knowledge and advice that underpins how we manage and protect Canada's marine and coastal resources.